In this short video tutorial, we will understand how to create an infinite for loop uh, in the C programming language. Although, uh, you know, when we have a program which has infinite loop, so that program will never end. So we will never want that our program should run and it should keep running for its entire life and it should not stop. We always want our program to complete the logic and then come to a stop. So normally you will not want to create infinite loops in your program because infinite loops are not good. But many times you have to implement some logic wherein you will want to implement an infinite loop. So the goal of this video tutorial is to help you understand how to create an infinite for loop. So suppose you have to write some logic in which you have to create an infinite for loop. So how can you how can you do that? Now to do this, uh, you have to simply write this code. Now if you notice this for loop, this for loop has no initialization, no condition check and no increment decrement. So basically when this loop will start running, it will keep running without without stopping ever because there is no condition that can make this loop stop. So if I run this program right now, you will notice that this program will kind of hang and it will never stop. So to just to give you an idea, although it's not good to, uh, it's not good to write infinite loops in a program, but just for you to understand, I have created this infinite loop and I'm printing A in this loop. So when I'll run my program, you will notice that it will keep printing A for endless number of times and it will not stop. So notice how it is printing A for endless number of times. So this is, I will have to forcefully stop this program so that I can come back to the uh, program. So this is an infinite loop and it will never stop. I would again like to mention that infinite loops are not good for the program, but many times you have to implement some logic in which you have to create an infinite loop. So whenever you have to create an infinite loop using the for loop, this is how you can do this by uh, leaving the initialization condition check and increment decrement parts of the for loop as empty. So there will be no initialization, no check, and this loop will keep running for infinite number of times. So with this, I hope you have understood how to create an infinite loop using the for loop. And we will end our short tutorial here. To access our complete C programming course, please visit openeschool.com slash learn C. Also, please subscribe to our channel to get regular updates on the new videos that we post.